here but what we notice is that the logo is kind of too large and kind of pushes the menu link here to the bottom so we need to take care of the header and we can't actually do that here in elementor we need to do that in the wordpress customizer so let's click on update to save the changes and then let's go to our website and click on customize then click on header mobile menu and then here we can add a separate logo for the mobile version which is what we want to do so let's click on select image then i'm going to choose one of the images of the logo so i'm going to choose this one here choose image and then for the maximum height for the logo i'm going to change this to 35 pixels and now when we click on publish and then go back to Elementor in the phone portrait mode. Then when we click and reload the page, we should see that the logo size has now changed. We actually need to go back to responsive mode, click on the mobile phone screen, and there we go. Now we can see the logo is smaller. So another thing you can do to see if the logo works is you can open up your website on your mobile phone and then just play around with this value here, the logo maximum height. Um, and make sure you enter an amount or a value that will end up in the logo looking great and not pushing away this menu here. And then there's a few more changes I wanna do to the mobile menu, which is I wanna get rid of the text here. I just wanna have this hamburger icon. So I'm gonna deselect the display menu text. And then when we click publish and reload here, responsive mode, click on the phone screen then we can see the menu text is now gone and i also want to for the hamburger button i want to change from default icon to 3dx because i think that's a, a nicer uh, animation design and click publish and then the last thing i want to also do is get rid of the search function so when we click on the menu here we can see that there's a search bar and we i want to get rid of this so i'm going to deselect the mobile menu search and then again click publish then to see if it worked reload the page go to responsive mode and click on the mobile phone screen again this would be faster if you just use your phone and then reload the page there so you can see the changes and now you can see the search bar is gone